Why should colleges allow people to get up on stage and preach about things that have been proven wrong decade after decade after decade? Things that have been proven wrong for over a hundred years. Why should they allow for that? Should they allow people to go up on stage and talk about how the moon is made of cheese? Should they allow people to go up on stage and declare that the earth is flat? You could say, well, yeah, they, they should allow that, and then we can prove them wrong. Yeah, but what if the, the, your, your attempts to prove them wrong is as futile as trying to prove the people who are flat earthers wrong? They'll just state that anything that you say is proof isn't actually proof and that it's computer generated. The same type of reasoning gets used by, uh, you know, uh, racists as far as, you know, well, no, we don't care about your proof. Uh, your proof is bullshit. We don't care how many studies have been done about this. I feel this way. I've seen these patterns. Therefore, what I say is true. Why should colleges allow for that type of thing? You could say, well, everyone needs to, to have a say. It's just like, well, what is the point of a college then? Is, is a college to, is it about debating stupid ideas? Or is it about higher education? I think that's something worth asking. Now, colleges can obviously go too far in those areas to where anything that dissents from the standard opinion is, is censored, and that's messed up, and that shouldn't happen. Now, people might say, well, you know, people like Milo and his gang are, uh, they often state things that are that are true. And I'm like, yeah, but so can the, the person who's blatantly racist who says that all black people are inferior. So can the person who says that the moon is made of cheese. So can the people who believe in a flat earth. They can state a lot of valid things too. Just these certain very particular areas, they state things that's, that are bullshit. Same thing goes on with, the, with Milo and the crew. They have some things that are bullshit. They have some things that are true. So is, is, is everything, you know, because they state some things that are true, we should just allow for it. You could say, well, what does it hurt to allow for this? It's like, well, if we are filling up time and effort in people to argue against ridiculous things, how is that higher education? Should education be about uh, how to debate stupid ideas? Is that what it should be about? Now, I also think that some of the, uh, the standard ideas that are being pushed out there, like within sociology classes, I think a lot of that stuff should be questioned more. That stuff needs to be questioned, and it's not being questioned. Well, look, feminist theory... Well, I mean, couldn't someone feasibly point to some paper and say, hey, look, racist theory. Look, believe me, because there's a bunch of papers that are written about this, you know, I, I, and people have categorized things this and this and this way. Well, other people have categorized things this and this and this way. That's not, that's not really an argument, you know. I think everything that the colleges are teaching should be questioned. But where do you draw the line?